tool to help loved ones bond with their babies, even when they can't be with them in person. She came screaming into this world, all two pounds, 10 ounces of her, and was immediately whisked to the NICU. Erica and Paul Cordial are the proud parents of baby Alexandra, who was born in April at only 28 weeks. And we were able to see her 24 hours a day, seven days a week in person if we wanted to. Uh, that was not something that was gonna work for us emotionally. It wasn't going to work logistically. But these special cameras helped the cordials bond with their new baby when they couldn't be at the hospital. It, we even worked it into our daily routine that way to help kind of start to form that emotional bond before she even came out. And a lot of times when we were working, we would have, you know, work on one screen and then on the second screen, we'd have Angel Eye pulled up. With our Patient Connect solution. The cameras are part of the Angel Eye program at Virginia Hospital Center in Arlington. It gives them a little peek into the NICU and a peek on their baby when they're not able to be here. So it would allow them to bond a little bit better, decrease their anxiety, and give them a little more peace of mind. Kristen Gannon is the patient care director of the neonatal intensive care unit. She says the idea came after attending a conference and getting input from parents. She says families have spent more than 800 viewing hours since the cameras went live back in February, and they hope to expand the program soon. We hope to expand this program to offer or to add five more cameras to our fleet to improve access for our twin families. Not only were these first time parents able to watch their new baby girl any time of day, they were also able to share access with relatives in upstate New York. We shared that link with grandmas, grandpa, aunts, uh, so our, our core family could check in on her and we would get text messages of, oh, she's, you know, looking really cute today or whatever, or will you please go home because I know you're at the NICU because I haven't been able to see her in three hours. After nearly two months in the NICU, Alexandra got to come home. She's now five months old and she's thriving. Her parents say they're grateful for the technology that helped them stay connected through that very stressful time. Since birth, she's gotten so much more personality. Physically, she's gained almost 10 pounds in that five months. But our experience with the Virginia Hospital Center NICU is one of that, while we hope we never have to do again, absolutely would feel comfortable if we had to. She looks like a happy baby in those pictures, doesn't she? Virginia Hospital Center was one of the first hospitals in our area to have these special cameras installed in the NICU. Families can sign up for the Angel Eye program as soon as their baby is in intensive care, and they can watch through an app on their cell phone or computer. The hospital says they've already had 32,000 total visits to the site. That's a lot of uh, eyes on those children. Now here's Jimmy Fallon.